Hey guys, so today you and I are going to talk about learning how to program in one year. So let's get into it. So the question in question was, Frederick, can I learn computer programming in one year? And the short answer is yes, depending on how you define learning how to write software or do computer programming. Uh, one year of uh, working on your development skills is going to be enough for you to learn how to write some fairly basic applications. You will not be at the level where anybody of any value to the industry is going to consider you a professional software developer. No company will look at you as uh, a veteran or like a, you're, you're not going to be considered to be a real professional after one year of experience. At best you will be considered a junior level programmer ready for an entry level job. Usually the time it takes for you to become good enough to work in the industry at a junior level or a mid-level or well if you're really really good you might get to a sort of senior level in uh, in that t time period it's going to be one two five years and the reason is basically that you sh uh, or rather the, u the usual way it goes is that you start out practicing yourself you used to go to school or college or something like that or you learn by yourself and that usually in order to get to a point where you can be useful to a company it will take you about a year to do at the very least because there's so much stuff that you need to know in order to make anything meaningful and even not it's not even about making something meaningful to even understand the things that other people are going to ask of you you can kind of think of it as learning a second language there's so much and so many like there's so many variants of how somebody could say something to you that even though you may not necessarily l need if, use all the words of a language yourself you're still going to have to learn quite a lot of it in order to be able to understand how other people express themselves and the same thing goes for software engineering i have worked with many many juniors by now and trained a few uh, quite a few of them as well and the pattern is always the same the first thing that a junior level developer needs in order to be to even be applicable to get into a job position at any company is the skills necessary to actually understand what we're telling them because if I tell you that oh I'm need I'm gonna need you to set up this react component or spin up this server or something like that and you don't even know what I'm saying you're useless. You're completely pointless. Then what? Basically, you're. Then I have to do it while you may watch. And sure, that we can absolutely do. If something, if you've never worked in our system, we will absolutely do that. But within, you can expect that within, at the most, say a, a few months or something like that. In many cases, it's much quicker than that people in a company are going to expect you to be able to do some stuff by yourself and it usually includes a range of tools so I've seen quite a few people who I just I kind of just wave my hands and I go I'm not gonna touch these comments I have they, ha they, they have too little understanding of what it means to be a software developer for me to help them where they say that they've learned something like I don't know CSS and HTML and now they're gonna go and try to find a job and I go you're not gonna find one I promise you you're not gonna find one at the very best if you if you are a web designer then maybe no but nobody's gonna hire you as a front-end developer if you just know that and I can promise you nobody's gonna hire you um, as a back-end developer if you know some data structures and a bit of Python or something like that it, it's not happening guys the thing that people are hiring from the industry are well it's at the very least people who can produce a basic version of the applications that they themselves are making money from and that's usually a web application in order for you to I can I can promise you right now in order for you to be able uh, to even be able to produce a basic system you're gonna need at least several months of work 
and I know this for a fact because I did the same thing when I, I guys they took me I think we worked like when I was in school it was, I, I, it was after my first semester we had just barely learned how to set up a very basic uh, web server in Java it was I think that's and that's like six months of work, work guys that's half your time period and at that point I just knew enough to kinda know how to set it up I didn't understand how all of that worked and I can promise you right here and now that it had the code base been anything besides we're talking about the basics of the basics here guys there's literally so little code that I can rewrite the whole project uh, within like 20 minutes that's how long uh, that's how long we spent in order to get to a point where we could set up the server, serve up some like CSS files and static HTML and like the absolute bare bone basics. So if that is your goal, to be able to do basic coding and then take yourself from that level to to the future or like to wherever you want to go, then absolutely you can learn how to program in one year. But if your question is if you're ready to take a job after one year, I will say in a best case scenario yes something like that but I will just also say that it is possible it's conceptually possible for someone to to get a job quicker than that or so forth as long I mean at the end of the day if you all if you can find a company that is willing to overlook your your inexperience then well, then nothing I say actually is even remotely true, even though it is the norm by practically every single per like I, I've never met a professional software developer who would not agree with the fact that the norm is that you usually need around one to five years of experience in order to make it in the industry. So what I want you to take away from this is that you can absolutely learn how to write software in one year that's absolutely possible but you should also know that even with one year of experience you may not be able to find steady employment because it's the quality of the years the the, the year that you spend learning that is going to dictate everything there are some developers who are either extremely fortunate and they get into the industry really really quickly they might like just take one boot camp and then they find this job somewhere where they can do some coding but and that's but I'm not even now talking about the quality of the work that they have to do because there, there's such a range of things that you could be doing so they might actually just have this kind of toy type of position where if they tried it again they would never find that job again so if you want to be in the range of where you need to be in order to be a employable software developer you're gonna look at one to five years roughly because that is what most of the job postings are looking for in their software developers with that said if you want to just learn how to write code and make your own projects a year is, is, is absolutely good enough to get to that level have a great day